who is she? I'm not sure. I guess we'll have to find out. There, girl. Here's your new style. I hope you like it here. Well, definitely not what I expected. Come on, Amber. You could have chosen a better high-class barn for moi. I mean, I'm a prized thoroughbred. I'm your only horse. At least give me what I deserve. Who's the snobby new mare? Great. Just what we need. Great. Just what I need. Ew. This entire barn is filled with a bunch of cattle horses. This is not going to look good on my record. Hey, new mare. You know, I have a name. Yeah, whatever. I need you to do something for me. Yeah, like what? I don't just go around doing people favors. Who do you think I am? Well, guess what? I don't really care who you are. I just need you to get this done. Whatever. What is it? Well, it's a bit hard to explain from here. Well, try, because I don't have all day here. So, first, I have a question. Are you good at crushing people's confidence? Ruining people's lives? Well, duh. Again, who do you think I am? I was born to do that. Great. Because I kind of need you to ruin a relationship. And here's how. Proceed. Again, I don't have all day. Shut up. I'm trying to think of a way your little peanut brain would understand. Just because I'm higher class than you doesn't mean I have a smaller brain. If anything, it's bigger. Great. I don't care. Well, okay, mister. I don't care about anything. What's your dumb plan? For your information, it's not dumb. It's probably a better plan that you ever could think of. Well, guess what, hon? This isn't my first rodeo. Ha! I just used country horse slang. <laughs> okay, but anyways, ew, that's gross. I've done this before, trust me. I know how to do this stuff, so leave it to me and your job will be done. Okay, fine. Let's see what Miss Peanut Brain can come up with. Again, I don't have a peanut brain. Whatever, just get it done. Fine, jeez. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but she seemed a little bratty. Ha, huh, I think you're right. But who knows? I never met the mayor. You're right. We can't judge her too soon. Great. Now Diesel sucked more horses into his stupid little plan. Ah, <sighs> she actually likes me. I've been waiting for this day my whole life. Max. Max. Oh, oh, Lavender. We were just meant to be. Ooh, I gotta start thinking of names for foals. Max. Earth to Max. Okay. Yoo-hoo. Yeah. Max. Oh, no, it's not yeah, yeah, what? Babe, you called? Babe? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oops, kind of forgot about that. Yeah, I, um... I've been calling your name. Yeah, sorry. I was just thinking about names for our future foals. Oh, goodness. Well, did you pick out any good ones? Not yet, but I'm still thinking. Well, okay, but can I have your attention for like one minute? Maybe even Archie. No, maybe that's not a good one. I gotta know what she likes. Yeah, that's, yeah. Okay, I'll have to talk to her. Max. Max. <gasps> babe. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Wait, you called me babe. Yeah, I guess I did. But can I talk to you? It's important. Yeah, sure. Anything. Max, I love you, babe. But it's seriously important. We need to talk. It has to do with Autumn and Dallas. Yeah, what about them?
Well, you know that everything that's been going on, there's kind of been a bit of change of plans. Like how? Instead of just preventing Diesel of ruining their relationship, he now kind of has like a little sidekick, or whatever you want to call it. But now the new mayor, Montana, is working with him. So we need to stop both of them instead of just Diesel. And now that there's two of them and only two of us, it's even game. Anything can happen. Yeah, we really should do something. Yeah, it's going to take a bit more strength. Lavender, my babe. Don't fear. Max is here. Ah, oh, great. Looks like I'm on my own with this one.